Austin Michael Guest, California State University, East Bay. Mark Michael McKibben, George Washington University. Amanda Dolores Loya, California State University, East Bay. Alexis Genoveva Jagola, UC Davis. <laughs> Connor Everett Sickler, Sierra College. Joshua Van Lau Jordan, UC Berkeley. Emily Elizabeth Marler, Louisiana State University, Baton Rouge. Alana Grace Rogers, Sierra College. <laughs> Chloe Alicia Parks, Folsom Lake College. <laughs> Reagan Marguerite Burks, American University. Austin Michelle Melton, American River College. <laughs> Lubo Nikolaevna Petrick, California State University, Sacramento. <laughs> Jamie Anita Megadu, California State University, Sacramento. Allison Michelle Hutton, Humboldt State University. <laughs> Michaela Mariah Melanson, UC San Diego. Marcus Ryan Sampson, University of Nevada, Reno. Corinne Isabella Pembroke, UCLA. <laughs> Alexis Rochelle Thomas, Western Washington University. Morgan Kayford Mullis. Mullis, Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. <laughs> Kaylee Nicole Harbaugh, Western Washington University. Victoria Jean Turner, UC Davis. Cassidy Ray Peterson, San Diego State University. Corey Judith McKee, Occidental College. Matthew Michael David Dodaro, Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Sarah Ann Morardi, UC Santa Barbara.
Ashlyn Rose Johnson, UC Davis. April Denise Muller, Sierra College. Lauren Rose Craig, UC Santa Cruz. <laughs> Haley Alexandra Freund, San Francisco State University. Rachel Natsumi Marquez, San Jose State University. McKenna Sierra Jones, San Diego State University. <laughs> Tressa Elizabeth Cummings, Graceland University. Skylar Madison Wolf, California State University, Monterey Bay. <laughs> Tamara Mikhailovna Bobchenik, California State University, Sacramento. Juan Alejandro Nardoni, the University of San Francisco. Kyle Cruz Hudson, Sierra College. <laughs> Amanda Baleen Lee Hall, Sierra College. Mercedes Marie Cruz, California State University, Sacramento. Adelina Rose Standish, Colorado State University. Annalise Mary Wyant, Cal Poly San Luis Obispo. Carson Lee Burns, University of Colorado Boulder. Paige Lynn Garvey, University of Nevada, Reno. I'd like uh, everyone to know that this is one of the largest graduating valedictorian classes that we've had in the past 15 years, so applause to you. I'd like to now welcome Dr. Michael McKibben. Representing the Board of Education this evening, Dr. McKibben was elected to the board in 2014. He's married to Dr. Celeste Rosenberry McKibben. His son, Mark, is a Cass Robo graduating senior and an honored speaker tonight during our program. Dr. McKibben received his baccalaureate degree from Purdue University and earned two master degrees and a doctorate from Columbia University. He's worked as a Peace Corps volunteer, a high school teacher, 
an elementary teacher, and a professor at four universities. Guests and graduates, please welcome Dr. Michael McKibben. This is a special graduation for me. I've known a lot of you since you were in early elementary school, and I've known one of you since birth. I want to talk a little bit today about lives that make a difference. This topic uh, was inspired uh, to me by my son, uh, and I use a quote from, with his permission from John Steinbeck. I wonder how many people I have looked at and never seen. Lives that make a difference. As I prepared these remarks, I asked to talk to some students, and we spent about an hour talking about how this class has made a difference over the years and the kinds of special things that you've done. I've had the wonderful experience to have a window and watching you for the last four years um, from the house over on Hazel. <laughs> and as I looked and as we talked about the things that made us special, our conversations kept coming back to how we take care of each other in our clubs, in our organizations, and how we've become a CASA family. To list a few examples that came out, giving blood, almost 200 pints this last year, working with students from Pasteur to build animal shelters at, at Folsom Zoo, volunteering as a designated driver, efforts to cur curtail bull bullying, both organized and random at times when seniors help freshmen and sophomores to get back on track or some kind on some kind of academic, personal, or social hurdle, and various other acts of kindness. For some, making a difference is defined as some great publicized accomplishment or recognition. And I suspect some of you will make that kind of differences. And I have no doubt that one day one of Mrs. DeFarcy's students will indeed find and isolate the strain for the Zika virus and so forth. But for most of us, making a difference is rather anonymous, not recognized, and in some cases, uh, not knowing whether what you did helped make someone better. <laughs> 